Hi, I'm John, the Unilets Engineer Termel. And if you search for DIY, do it yourself, P2P, person to person, money, you will find my video where I explain how the Let software can be used by anyone to run their own local currency system. But I'm introducing the idea of everybody printing their own currency based on their valid Facebook ID. In that video, I go over the history of the LET system, the innovations that have happened to make counterfeiting harder, and we eventually ended up at this better system. Okay, this is my one half hour IOU worth six ten dollars. When I sign it, I owe it, and it should be collectible like any normal debt. And if someone else signs it, that's fraud. And it should be as prosecutable as any other fraud. So even though it looks like a dinky toy, see what it did in Argentina. In a working class suburb of Buenos Aires, hundreds of people newly impoverished by the nation's economic crisis gather several times a week at this disused factory to take part in their own self-help solution to the disaster. This is a barter market, one of thousands which have sprung up throughout Argentina thousands. to fill some of the gaps left by the collapse of mainstream business. Here, trading is carried out using coupons called creditos, which can only be used inside the club. The network of barter markets has become a parallel economy. You can call it money, but that wasn't our intention. We simply use it to represent the value of work. But we aren't going to build a new financial system. Sure you are. Our credits are loaned without interest. That's why. We don't say like the IMF does, I'll lend you 100, but you must pay back 150. No, we lend 100 and we say, pay back 100 in goods, services or skills that the network needs. A lot of people come from chronic unemployment or sometimes from the absolute impossibility of ever having access to work. And starting from these modest tables where they put themselves at the service of other people through a product or a service, these people gain fortitude which enables them to hold their own in the global economy more strongly. Sorting their chips. Packages of money for new members. It's the only banknote that I have, but there are plenty more, he says. It's worth 20 credits. There's also some worth 10, 5, 2, and 1. It's not money, it's a credit, a little piece of paper. You can buy what you need clothing, food, poker chips. Okay, so time barter is something poor people can do to help themselves. So what's the difference between their creditos and my time dollar credits? The difference is those people had to promise a hundred bucks worth of goods and services to borrow a hundred bucks from the network. And in my system, they have to promise a hundred dollars worth of goods and services to borrow a hundred bucks from themselves who print up the money instead of the network. This is a do-it-yourself. And when you sign it, it becomes your money, like a traveler's check, like any other check. Now, how you do it? How do you make your money? Well, you go to johntermel.com slash unilets, and there you'll be able to get templates like I use here, okay? That print out five notes one side, six to ten on the other, and then you can always add your serial numbers to up if you're gonna print out more. But then you print out green ones for one dollar, time dollars, and red ones for 50, and blue ones for six to half an hour. So all you have to do is print up one page of half hour notes, one page of one hour notes, one page of four hour notes, and two pages of five minute notes, the one time dollar reach, to have $700 in time dollars. Now, again, this is do it yourself. Now, why is this so much better than the other system? 
It's because you can use your Facebook ID as the validator of your credits. So what we ask you to do is go to the website, print your templates, then go and make up a list of which serial numbers you printed. Get ready and post it at, with a selfie of yourself with your time dollars at your Facebook page or at your website validating those chips, those notes as yours. You'll put back 700 if you spend it. That's the deal. If you look at my page, I have these categories. I have a wish list, things I want, things I offer, as well as my accounts, hours given, hours received. Well, your first transaction should be basically, I'm taking out so many green dollars, okay? I took out 1400 my first one. And then after that, you may not need too many more transactions. But I used to log every time I did community service. I would log it. Every time I did something I thought was worth the community, I would put it there as a community service credit hour earned. For instance, I play accordion concerts on Tuesdays in all folks' homes, and I mark two hours every time because those hours count. Now, here's how the system works and it is a bit different. This is a note, okay? And you notice it says, I owe slash thank you half an hour. Well, if I scratch out the thank, I owe you half an hour, and I sign it, John Termel, I owe you. That's a debt. But when I go and I play my accordion at Riverview, and I do a concert there, I made the witness sign two hours worth, and that way I have I thank you. See the difference? I thank you for a half an hour, Mary, my witness. So that means any kid could go print himself up some notes, go out and clean up a park, and ask someone to witness his hours for him, and they become usable in our network. In which case, if I were to do something and nobody was watching, I would simply witness it myself. Simple as that. Who's going to lie if they could get caught? That's it. So, now, what you got to do is you have to go put up the selfie announcing that you're participating in the time dollars. You have to post your wish list. We want to know what you're offering and what you have. And remember, the pledge is to put back what you take out to the network. So that is the deal. And that's why anybody can now do it on their own and should. There's no excuse to sit in poverty anymore if you and a group can start your own money system and not be poor anymore.